is with profound joy and with much delight that I welcome to address us today the Executive Chairman <laughs> of the Council Group of Companies, yours and mine, the Kwame Opposite Banco. Akwaba to Alisa Hotels. The true definition of the Ghanaian hospitality. Indeed, it gives me great honor to stand before you on this August occasion, the official opening of Alisa Hotel Tema, the latest addition to the Alisa. This imposing edifice you see today has come to reality by the of hard work, especially as majority of the construction was done during the COVID-19 pandemic. The civil guests, some 35 years ago, I was ardent in my person to impact my generation as well as inspire the generation after. This led me to build the Bouncy Group at a second space, Gloucester Aluminium, and Elisa Hotels. During the early days of seconds, when my principals from Holland visited Ghana to train local artisans in Car Spring, housing them was a challenge. This is when the idea of Elisa Hotel was conceived, and a 14 room boutique hotel came on board at La Bonne. On completion, I deemed it appropriate to name it after my cherished mother, Alisa Mania. She is Mama Alisa. Within the last 20 years, the Alisa Hotel Group has grown into a trusted brand, <coughs> offering maximum comfort at each of these populations, with Alisa Tema being the latest addition. Distinguished guests, the significance of Tema Kado be overemphasized in my journey as a businessman. Tema is where my business foundation was laid. At a young age of 20, before bringing skins into Ghana, I used to supply building materials such as iron rods, nice pipes, copper pipes, steel plates, among others, to the Nostra Hub of Tema. I there with companies such as Ghana Cement Works, now Gasem, Tema Food Complex, Tema Shipyard, Liver Brothers, to name a few. Those were really difficult times. I'm glad to have met people like this. I shown now the then chief engineer at Gasem of Ghana Cement West and Mr. Sami Gamra, among others. This really guess, this was during it was during those days that the Reformed Meridian Hotel was at its peak, where people met and unwind after hard day's work. This memory provided the inspiration of what we are witnessing today. They will truly have their lifestyle back. As a company, we are passionate about growth, impact, and sustainability. We have grown significantly and succeeded in providing employment for about 750 persons as a group. <laughs> With Alisa alone employing up to 500. I'm delighted to be here this morning to open formally the camera branch of Alisa Hotel, which undoubtedly is one of the biggest and best hotels we have in Ghana. I'm here not just because the owner of this hotel, Kwame Ufusu Banfu, is a very good friend of mine. Also, not because the rich branch of the Elisa Hotel has served over the years as the alternate venue of the meetings of the New Patriotic Party's National Executive Committee and National Council, but because of my government's vision of helping to market the country as an exciting destination for leisure, conferences, sports, health, educational and cultural tourism. The existence of hotels such as Alisa is critical to the realization of this vision. And I congratulate the man, popularly referred to and known as Sikkis, and his partners for the brilliance of this initiative. And many of us who have had the opportunity of knowing him 
we are aware it has not been an easy journey for him. What we're seeing today is the result of commitment, dedication, and hard work. I'm about for Two, three, four, and five. To God be the glory, ladies and gentlemen.